Outrageous. NPO launches a large-scale hate campaign against news broadcaster Anjhoord Nederland. There is an extraordinary situation in the Netherlands. The NPO, the public broadcaster, is financed with tax money, and you would, therefore, expect that the offer reflects society. Nothing is further from the truth, for the NPO is as left as possible. They drown and ban the right-hand sounds and refuse to tolerate it. Those people who sound to the right, they ridicule, like the victims of character assassination. Large-scale hate campaign. You would expect that a news broadcaster who wants to bring more diversity and who wants to break the monotony, will be welcomed with open arms. That appears not to be the case. Immediately after the establishment of Anjhoord Nederland, the NPO started a large-scale hate campaign against the news broadcaster. Your tax money goes there. Not to external programs that make you wiser, but to hate campaigns to suppress unpleasant noises. This NPO is terrified of broadcasters, who make a different sound. Imagine, unheard of the Netherlands shown as citizens, lied to, about many issues all this time. An endless barrage of left-wing hatred would follow like in the United States, where the term fake news originated. That is what the NPO wants to prevent at all costs. And so the Dutch taxpayer is treated to an endless barrage of leftist hatred. How does that look? Very simple, according to an old recipe, some left-wing figureheads are pushed forward and put into position, and the anti-Semitic card played. Nasty game. The NPO is terrified of a new broadcaster who wants to make an unpleasant sound in Hilversum. And so that broadcaster must disappear at all costs. Everything is allowed, and they play a very nasty game, as shown above. A concerned citizen.